On May 4th, the Little Rock Police Department received a call of a subject down near Greenway and Belmont. It was 23-year-old James Wiggins who had been shot and killed. Our Haven Hughes sat down with Wiggins' family. And Haven, I know this is still a very difficult time for them. Absolutely, Katrin. Difficult to say the very least. Wiggins leaves behind family members that can't sleep at night, desperate for answers and longing for justice. While the gunman remains on the loose and is unidentified, Wiggins family says they won't stop until they see someone behind bars, paying for their pain and their loved one's life. A body found near Greenway and Belmont Drive and a family unsure of their loved one's whereabouts. I called all day at work, still no James, which was that was that was strange because James talked to his family every day. Left with no information or contact. You have no messages. But a ping from Life 360 told them their worst fear. That's your son's phone and I'm almost sure that's your son's body. Words that ripped Wiggins' family hearts out and reminded even the youngest one of them of who he was and should be still. He was a good person. He, he would love me to death. I love him a lot. I would never stop talking about him. A life-changing day that Wiggins' family can't understand. To kill him, shoot him four times. A young man, they say, who would have given you anything you wanted if you would have just asked. James loved everybody. James would give you the shirt off his back. A kind heart, they say, that loved with all he had. All our children are special, but James was special because of the true love he had for his family and just about anybody he met. They hope to see his killer behind bars one day soon. We'll take him away. And never come back here again. During sleepless nights waiting for information, one word comes to mind. Justice. Somebody took his life. I just, I just need some justice for James. And I can't rest until I get it. Well, Wiggins family says giving up is not an option. The Little Rock Police Department asked the community if you have any information that could benefit this investigation to please call the anonymous tip line at 501-371-4636. Live in studio, I'm Haven Hughes, KRK4 News. Back to you.